This video is for teachers who need to self-register on FOSWeb, that is, teachers whose districts have not set up teacher accounts using data from their SIS, or Student Information System. If your district has already created an account for you, please contact your district SIS administrator for your account information. Please note that if your district has not rostered for FOSWeb through School Specialty via Clever, you cannot use single sign-on with Clever. Teachers can self-register on FOSWeb in a few short steps. From the FOSWeb homepage, www.fosweb.com, find the register link below the login area. Next, click the button labeled Click Here to register for FOSWeb on the following page. This page provides information on who should register as a member of an organization and who should register as an individual. Most teachers will register as a member of an organization. Register as an individual if you can't find your district or school in the lookup database or you are an international teacher. To start the process, enter your school or district issued email address at the top of this page and click Next. Select whether you are registering as a user within an organization or as an individual and click Next. Click the Yes radio button and then put in a few keywords from your organization in each required field. The required fields are the organization name, city, country, and state. The database lookup works best if you put in one or two keywords from your organization's name as opposed to the full name as the database requires an exact match. For example, if your school's name is George Washington Carver Elementary School, Enter simply Carver in the field to find your school. Once you've filled out the required fields, click Search. The search results appear below the search form. Click the drop-down menu to find your organization, and then click the Next button. Fill out your personal information on this page, including first and last name, school phone number, school mailing address, and your role and grade level. Click the Next button to submit. Create a password that is secure, but something you'll remember. It is required to be eight characters or longer. After your account is created, you can always change your password using the Reset Password link on the login page. You now have an account on FOSWeb. Click the Login Here link to go to the home page and log in. You'll soon have access to a rich array of module resources to enhance your teaching. But first, you'll need to enter an access code to open up those resources. If you need help, find the Entering Access Codes video on the FOSWeb Walkthrough Videos page. For answers to frequently asked questions, please visit our Help page. You can also contact us using the form on our Contact Us page.